Okay guys, consider liking, subscribing, and sharing. And check out Georgia Constitutional Media. I'll put the link to his channel in the description. So this guy was exercising his First Amendment rights in public. Remember, filming the police is your right. And when you deal with law enforcement across the country, you gotta understand that these cops are not your friends. This is why it's important to take the time and film law enforcement in the United States always film the police remember we there's a reason why we have a united states constitution these cops cannot be trusted and at the end of the day man you have to film them if it ain't on camera it didn't happen so always film the police original links are in the description so back at the health department part two i didn't want to bore y'all today i've seen they call the police I didn't want to run away. Let's we'll see. How are you, sir? How you doing today? Oh, good, man. How are you? What's, What's your name, badge number? I'll just do a little filming in public. Filming in public? Yes, sir. Okay. Were you inside the building? Yes, sir. Right now? Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, uh -huh. actually, you can't. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. Because there are privacy things going on in there that you can't be filmed. Right, is that what they say? Well, okay. I mean, that's... That's the law? That, in that building, yes. Okay, all right. Uh, well, you got an ID on you? I don't, I didn't, no. I just don't want to do that. I ain't really broke no laws. I'm just filming in public. Well, uh, quick question. Quick question, not to interrupt. This is public building, health department. Okay. Okay. I was never asked to leave. Never. Okay. They asked me to turn the camera off. I do this all over Georgia, South Carolina. And uh, I actually got escorted back into Richmond County uh, Health Department yesterday once I was kicked out. They sent me back in to show them it was okay. Here's the thing. The police officers will try to enforce policy over law. These officers do not respect you nor your rights to come in public. It's either their way or the highway. Understand, you cannot trust law enforcement in the United States. Get back to the video. Not gonna do that here because I'm getting tired, ready to go home. But uh, just kind of look it up and see what's going on. The HIPAA, the only people that can um, infringe on HIPAA rights is people that's been HIPAA trained. Well, but that's what it boils down to. Right. When when they have clients inside of an office, in right, there, it's their job that's to their privacy. Right, there. it's their job to protect them. And what I did, you'll see in the video. I had them shut that door. They had the door open where I could film the patients. I said, listen, you have to create privacy in public. She said, what does that mean? I said, shut the door. And she shut the door. I said, let's start there. Let's start number two. I hit the button to go up. She said, you can't go upstairs. I said, let's put a sticker there. So you understand what I'm doing, right? I'm a First Amendment auditor. I go around, educate yeah, right from wrong. That's, that's what I'm fine. doing. And I really think I taught them a lot. So I'll leave with this. Just look it up. Look up that I got more right in there filming than she does saying I can leave. So, that was their concern. And that, there you go. And, you know, but, yeah, there's nothing that prohibits it. They can put signs up. I actually had uh, the administrator take the sign down in Richmond County um, because it was an illegal signage. So what was your name, badge number again? You got an ID? No, sir. Well, I got one, but I'm, I don't really... I hadn't broken any laws, so I don't really but want to give it. I don't know that you haven't broken any laws because I don't know who you are. But, well, so that's why I'm asking for your ID. How's that going to fix name? anything? I'll give my first name. Find, okay. Oh, first first name, Ben. How do you think we find people who well, have warrants and everything outside? That ain't how. Well, then you... Yes, uh, I check your name, date of birth. Right, then you infringe on their... See what I'm talking about? You no, can't just run. Infringing. That ain't, yeah. No, that's me doing my job to find out who you are because I don't know if you're a wanted person or not. Well, I don't know. So here's the thing. The ID to the police officers do, does not tell them if a law is being broken or not. That is one of the most common lies the police try to say. They always try to say, if you give me your ID, I will determine if there's a crime committed or not. Giving an officer your ID doesn't determine anything. All, they, all they're going to do with your identification is run you for warrants. You cannot trust these police officers because they're not your friends. This is why it's always important.
to film law enforcement in the United States, always film the police. Get back to the video. It, uh, unless I've broken any laws, I don't have to ID. And I hadn't. I, matter of fact, I've really, I really taught her a lot, you know. And I do this pretty much for a living. And, uh, and I'm just going to, am I being detained? I haven't detained you. Okay, y'all have a very, very wonderful time. That's going to be Aiken Public Safety. The number is going to be, I think it's 706-648. I'll have to look it up. So here's the thing. This man did a very good job on dealing with law enforcement. He stood his ground and exercised his First Amendment rights. In this next video that you're about to see, he gets pulled over by, I believe, a deputy. And they do not respect his rights. The fact that they try to run him for warrants is sad. Get back to the video. I'm going to me over Gotta have some good damn reason to pull me over. Hey, what's your name and badge number? Why am I being pulled over? I don't get my name out. Why am I being pulled over? Why don't you? I do that wrong. Okay. Okay. Uh, you, I mean, what reason? What law have I broken? Well, get a supervisor. <laughs> get a supervisor, because I'm For telling what? you, I'm a First Amendment auditor doing a First Amendment, Second Amendment protected activity. The police was called on me. You blocked me in leaving. You better have a damn good reason. Or you better say goodbye. Oh, that's not how that's okay, all right. Okay. You got your body cam on? It's on. It's all right. Flashing. I do. Okay. Sir, what do you got going on? Right I don't answer questions. Then why don't you answer questions? Because I didn't do nothing wrong. Okay. You see where we're going with this? Yeah, you just want to try to stir up. No, something? I'm a First Amendment auditor. Yeah. Doing a First Amendment audit is a protected activity so, on the First so what's, Amendment. What's, what were you doing then that's with your First Amendment? Filming in public. Mm -hmm. What did the First Amendment? Let's test you I'm out. No, I know what they are. I mean, that's why I'm up. You, you swore oath. Correct. Okay, what are they? I don't know. You don't know? No. Nope. Damn it, man. I know, right? So All right, First, First Amendment. First Amendment. What's going on? This is why you should always film police. Remember, it is your right to do so. These guys are not your friends. Look at him pulling him over and sitting there chilling, just straight up chilling like he's cool. So always film the police. Get back to the video. Freedom of speech, freedom of religion, uh -huh. freedom of what's that? Cell phone? Press. Okay. Any individual can film in public. Anything their eyes can see from public. Uh -huh. Okay. I mean, that's what I'm doing. They come out. They confronted me. I told them what I was doing. They walked up there. Said, you know what? We talked to a deputy, man. You're pretty cool. So I come back down here. They point you in. And here we are. Okay. And I'm trying to find out what crime I broke. So there's no crime broke. Am I being detained? Yeah. Be careful. Am I being detained? Okay. For what crime have I committed? For an investigation. You don't have to be detained for a crime. You have to suspect me of a crime. Right. I was dispatched here for a call, right? Right. Right. I didn't. Well, why aren't you talking to them? I didn't call you. Well, I'm asking you. I was leaving. The person I was called for, right? I was leaving. Okay. I'm out there. You were, your vehicle was giving us a mm -hmm. yep, right? sitting right over there. Alright, as I pulled up, you were leaving. Mm -hmm. Going back through. to work. Right? So, here I am. Trying to find out why I'm in public filming. No, I had no problem with you. Oh, no, well, that's all I'm have doing. I I'll answer that phone? part. No. Have I addressed your phone at all? No, that's all. Okay. What's the name of this road? So, sir, have I addressed your phone at all? No. Have I had, so turn no. your phone off. No. So no, but you're blocking I, my car how because stopping your First Amendment. You've got this patrol car in front of that me. Has nothing to do with your First Amendment. Right? Yes. Right or wrong? Wrong. Why am I being detained? Because I was called here. I was oh. dispatched for legal reasons. I just told you what the reason was. Okay. Why am I being detained? So I have to investigate that. Investigate it. Do you think I believe everything I'm told by everybody else? No, and that's okay, what so that's why But I you gotta be you didn't know what ID, the, No 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 and no, why no. not? Because I have not I have to commit a crime. No you do not. Georgia is a show state. No. Wait a minute, you said Georgia okay. 
Okay, show me. I need a supervisor. If you just told me Georgia is a stop and ID state. Yes. All right. Okay. 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 You can do it like that. Is this your vehicle? No. Vehicle I don't answer questions. Okay. But it ain't mine. And I need a supervisor. That's the second time on body cam. I need a supervisor. Thank you. What's your uh, request for I'm being detained illegally. And now you're legally detained, but okay. And you told me. And you told me a lie. You told me that it's a stop and ID state. Before you get yourself in trouble and sue, lose your qualifying immunity, you think I, you think it's the first time this has happened? No, no, no. Come on, man, you better than this. Here's the thing. These deputies do not respect our rights. The only time they really care about the Constitution is when they're being sworn in as law enforcement officials. But besides that, they just don't care. This is why it's always important to film law enforcement in the United States, always film the police. Remember, these guys are not your friends and they cannot be trusted. You need to film the police. Get back to the video, man. Supervisor's tied up. There's another one responding from a different zone. Right. Sounds good. Okay, then we'll hang out. How's that sound? It don't sound good. Request, right? That was my request, unless I'm free to go. No, not yet. Not yet. You can do all your recording, you just gotta do it over here. Oh, I'm, I'm good. Yeah, you can't record what's on the you, you have to protect it. That's I'm just I'm just teaching you something else. You have to protect that. You have to say okay, that's what I'm telling you. Well close it. You have to close it if you want me to stop. That's I know that rule too. That ain't my first one. Jesus Christ, man. Stop an ID state. Feel free. Triple A sign company. Give them a call. Let them know. Let them know. What uh? What uh? What they call? These police officers do not respect the Constitution, man. Here's the thing: he ran his tags to get his name. He does not respect the Constitution, which is the Fourth Amendment, the right to privacy in your person, papers, and your facts. Your ID is your papers. And this officer does not respect that. See, the problem is, they, it's, there's, it's more common than you think. So always film the police. Get back to the video. I guess it's been a month I was out here. I did another video over there. Yeah. And it turned out a lot different. Yeah. I'll post that one also. Human hell. It is warm. I'm going to show you the video. I don't know. Pull it up now. Oh, well. They say anything about a drone? Say what? They say anything about a drone? Yeah. I know you from somewhere too. I can't get your way. Yeah, they said you were flying a drone. Is that illegal? Huh? Is that illegal? No. Not unless so? you're entering areas that 
Oh, really? You're, you're free to record anything that the public eye can see, right? Right, right, yeah. How far you think somebody owns up in the air? Say if you ever got a drone call, just, just throw it. Oh, no, I'm not the air traffic police. I know. What are they called? I don't know. I didn't apply for them. How long can you legally detain someone before you have to let them go? You know how many minutes? Well, there's no, there's no set time. Or, the is reasonable. Well, I think it's 20 minutes in Georgia, right? I don't think so. You're welcome to Google it and see. Oh, I already know. You got another phone? Oh, I already know. That's why I'm asking you. You requested a supervisor, so you're... Unless so I'm free to go. And you are not free to go. There we right. go. How, oh, so 20 minutes. No, there he is. That's not quite how that works. I think so, but right. we'll see. Where'd you minutes. go to school at? Huh? Where'd you go to school? school on a personal level. You didn't? We don't have to share that information. Well, I'm just asking. You asking me. There he is. B40. How long you been a deputy? Short time. Oh. You're going to learn something. Okay. How are you? Hello, my friend. Well, shh, people's watching. Will you tell him that uh, Georgia is not a stopping ID state? Okay. And I am where illegally you, detained. Just, uh, I'm illegally detained. Okay. I've been asked to leave twice. I've been illegally detained 14 minutes, 38 seconds. Okay. And all he says was somebody called me for filming in public. And I asked him what crime I committed. And he's like, he's investigating. And I told him to call you. And, and, and what happened is somebody did call mm -hmm. in reference. They said you had a GoPro and a drone and all mm -hmm. that stuff. And once he finds out, once he calls and talks, he finds out exactly what you're doing. Mm -hmm. You're free to go. Well, thank you. I mean, uh, Can you but, talk to him when I, mean, I leave? I'll, I'll explain that. Okay, him. appreciate uh, that. I'm gonna pull. Listen, I'm gonna pull both body cams. And I want to hear that conversation because there's going to be a lot of people bashing y'all, and I don't want that. Okay. I, this is an education, not a shit show. I'm not doing this to make fun of y'all. When we do get a call I understand. about somebody, we'd have to come see what you're doing. Now, I know once that. you realize that you're just filming and just not yeah, doing right. anything illegal, you you're free to go. Okay, thank you so much. Yeah, Did you learn something? Did you learn something? We're going to agree to disagree. Okay, just teach you. And uh, he, he, he did not know the First Amendment. He knows the Second Amendment. And if he would have asked for the ID for my Second Amendment, I'd have had to give it to him, but he didn't think about that. Y'all have a good day, man. Y'all take it easy. And there you go. Augusta, Georgia. School time. Consider going to Constitutional Media's channel. I'll put the link to it in the description. I'm giving my final thoughts and commentary to this video. If you do not want to hear it, you can leave. Okay? Three, two, one. So, Constitutional Media, or Georgia Constitutional Media, did a very good job on dealing with these law enforcement officials. Here's the thing. These officers don't respect the Constitution they sworn oath to. They only respect it when they're being sworn in as police officers. But after that, they don't care about it. You know how it is. This is why it's always important to film law enforcement in the United States. Or always film the police. These officers do not respect your rights to film in public. So filming the police is your right. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as it takes time to add additional commentary. I'm out guys. Peace out and all original links are in the description. Bye bye now and um have a wonderful day. I'm turning this off now.